the spring 2012 woman semester. One of the main things I've learned from Woolman is to live my life in abundance. Abundance of homework, <laughs> abundance of friends, abundance of cute sheep that wander the hillsides, and an abundance of just laughter and enjoyment for what this has been for me. When I first came to Woolman, I was petrified. I thought that I had made an enormous mistake. I think my exact thoughts were, oh my god, it's going to be a long 16 weeks. <laughs> um, this, we had to live in small cabins with complete strangers. We had to walk to our shared bathroom where we had to wear shoes if we wanted to take a shower. Uh, we had these classes with such unbelievably huge amounts of homework. work it was difficult for me I'm I don't know how I made it I'm glad I did and after being a woman it showed me that I could do a lot of different things the most amazing thing about this place is that I never would have guessed what I could have learned here when I came here I just didn't know what would await me <laughs> woman has just kind of taught me so many things not just through the classroom Though we did learn a lot in the classroom, I have to say that what I will be taking back with me is what I learned in the community. My time here has been full of laughter, stress, and fun. Some days were cloudy, gray, and full of work, but at the end of the day, I would lay in my bed all warm and cozy in my cabin. And I was always really grateful for this place and the amazing things that I had learned in just one day. Before I came here, I don't think that I really learned, I really knew what it meant to be passionate about things and to truly love the work that I am doing. But now, I do, and it feels really right. You can feel that throughout the semester that people want you here and that you're really making a difference. I think I came to Woolman with with a goal. I, I wanted to look into peace, justice, and sustainability, find one thing I loved, run with it, go to college, and then maybe become a famous activist, if, if I was lucky, maybe. Um, I was looking for the solutions to all my questions. I, I was looking for the answers to the world. I didn't find that. I found more questions. I, I've learned so much here, and I've really found that there's not one thing that I'm interested in. I'm interested in everything because everything is connected. But at Woolman, I have been able to ask questions that I can't answer, and I've learned things that I hadn't even thought of before. I'm still wondering things like, what is violence? What is sustainability? How do I feel about these concepts I'm learning about? And I'm thrilled about it. I came out of a deep need to know place and people. I think I discovered that this comes when one discovers oneself. I'm overjoyed to find myself feeling present here and whole. And being here at Woman taught me a lot about community and just working together on projects <laughs> at Woman. Everything we do is centered around love for both our own inviolate space and that of the community. It can really be that simple. We are encouraged to love and not judge each other and ourselves. That's NBC in a nutshell. We are invited to love what we do, from homework assignments to goat herding to pottery. We are urged to love the earth and the people and medicine and appreciate all of these things on Thursday night dinners. It's about taking the time to love the intersections of many selves and finding the space to love yourself. Such is the stuff of woman. The most important thing that I've learned here is that there are people in my generation who see the problems in this world and who want to fix them and when I go home I, I know that I can find some people um, who want to help the world and who are almost, if I'm lucky, will be almost as thoughtful and caring as the people I met and knew here. You 
You've helped me become confident in who I am and what I believe. Woolman has given me the tools, the knowledge, helped me to explore my interests and my beliefs and question everything. The world needs all of us. The countertop scrubbers, the pot scrapers, the sanitizers, the moppers and the sweepers. We can sing while we work. We can be joyful in the knowledge that when it comes time for us to eat, that we are reaping the fruits of our labor. There is a lot of harmony and elasticity that I've discovered here between living and learning. This place has also taught me that it's okay to want to be alone and to find your own space. I have learned more at Woolman than I ever have anywhere else. Another tidbit that I've picked up at Woolman is that we can't get to be whole by making achievements, be they academic, athletic, or artistic. We can't get to be whole if we focus only on what we do. The only thing we can do, really, is love. If we love ourselves, if we love each other, if we love what we do, and if we love what surrounds us, the pieces come together. I just can't express how grateful I am to this semester. And I just want to cling on to it and hold on to it for my entire life and never, ever, ever let go. Thank you, Woolman, for testing me and stretching me and pushing me and teaching me. Even though there were a lot of hard times, I did it. And like, my mom says she's proud of me, but I'm just so, so proud of myself. Like, we are grateful for your contributions to the Woolman community, and we send with you our hopes that you find your deepest joy in your highest purpose.